Vasectomies are reversible. I always say to patients, yes, it's reversible. If reversed within the first 10 years, it's about 70% successful. However, you should regard it as permanent. I, I say that so people make a very well-considered decision about what should be considered to be permanent contraception. However, life circumstances change and a good number of men come back wanting it reversed. Now, successful reversal depends on it being reversed within the first 10 years. It depends on the technique that was used in the original vasectomy. For example, was an excessive length of tube removed or was excessive diathermy used that would damage the small vas tube. These technical issues are very important. Whenever I do a vasectomy, I always have the microsurgical reversal in mind. That way my patients are set up for reversal should they want it. The vasectomy reversal procedure involves a one day admission to hospital, a general anaesthetic, two small incisions in the scrotum, a three hour operation under a high powered operating microscope, and thereafter the patient is discharged. He needs to live quietly for a month. Quietly means no sport, gym or sex for a month. He can go back to an office type job within a day or two. After a month, the patient can resume normal activity and we do our first post-operative sperm count six weeks after the microsurgical reversal. It can take six months to 12 months before fertility is restored.